Programming a universal remote for your Sharp TV. Hello and welcome. Today we're going to talk about how to program a universal remote for a Sharp TV. This is a common task, but it can sometimes be tricky if you're not familiar with the process. But don't worry, we're here to guide you every step of the way. Why do we need codes for a universal remote? A universal remote control is a device that can be programmed to operate various brands of one or more types of consumer electronics devices. To work with your specific Sharp TV, we need the specific codes that correspond to Sharp as a brand. Once programmed correctly, the universal remote will be able to control the volume, turn the TV on and off, and change channels. What are the codes for a Sharp TV? The specific codes for a Sharp TV may vary depending on the model of your universal remote. However, here are some commonly used Sharp TV codes that are used with many universal remotes. 004, 019, 081, 104, 107, 127, 139, 144, 160. Try these codes first. If they don't work, you'll want to refer to the instruction manual of your specific universal remote for a more exhaustive list of Sharp TV codes. How to program your universal remote with the Sharp TV codes. Let's go through the steps to program your universal remote with the Sharp TV codes. 1. Turn on your Sharp TV. You want the TV to be on so you can know when the remote has synced with the TV. 2. Point the remote at the TV. You should aim it directly at the front of the TV. 3. Press and hold the TV button on the remote. This button may also be labeled device or mode, depending on your remote. 4. Enter the first code from the list above. Use the number buttons on the remote to enter one of the codes listed above. 5. Watch for the TV to turn off. If the TV turns off, this means the code has worked. If not, repeat steps 3 and 4 with the next code on the list. 6. Save the code. Once the correct code has been found, you'll need to save it. Usually, this is done by pressing a button like Enter or Save. 7. Test the remote. Try using the remote to turn the TV on and off, adjust the volume, and change the channels to make sure it's working properly. There you have it. You should now be able to control your Sharp TV with your universal remote. Remember, if the first code doesn't work, try the next one. It can be a bit of trial and error, but once you've found the right code, you'll be all set. We hope this guide has been helpful to you, and happy viewing!